My name is Rosalind. Rosalind Amo. Okay. Uh, Madam Rosalind Amo, I want us to talk about Ghana, um, the history of Ghana as far as athletics is concerned. So you realize that Ghana athletics have come way back in the 1960s. Um, Ghana was among some of the first countries to win athletic medals at both the African Games, the Commonwealth Games, and they also impressed at the Olympic Games. So you talk of the likes of Stan Lialote, the ECO, Ade, Mike Ahe, Rose Hart, Alice Anum, all of them. And in, I mean, in the 70s, you talked about Ohne Kalkeri, the Ignatius Gazers, the Eric Kansens, the Leo Miles Mills, Theo Akodram, Hari Edufum. Talking of females, we've had the likes of Vaide Nim, Margaret Simpson, and so we, we have played key roles in athletics. We've gone beyond Africa to even become world champions. Margaret Simpson won silver at the world championships. Geza had also won. Eric Nkansa and Co. had all won bronze and silver. And so Ghana has a very rich experience when it comes to athletics. Wow, that's quite some history. Now, I want to talk about um, your experience as far as the day one of the athletics is concerned. As a Ghanaian, I was excited. We presented six athletes, and out of the six, five qualified for the semi-finals. And so this evening, they will be on show again. The sixth person who didn't qualify, 100 meters is not her race. She's on again for the 200 meters, which is her stronger event. And so this evening, I mean, tomorrow when she lines up for 200 meters, I know she's going to qualify for the semi-finals. Is Ghana going for gold? Of course. I mean, it's always you, re you aim for the stars. If you don't get the stars, at least you get something from the sky. And so we want, the mission is that Operation Win Gold on home soil. You can't come from a country that is rich in gold and not target gold. So for me, having spoken to the athletics team, their focus is to win gold in everything that they do. If not, at least they will still want to finish on the podium. Wow, now you seem to know much more about athletics. Now, I want to know your role over the years. What has your role been over the years? I'm a sports journalist. <laughs> I'm a sports journalist and I've been covering sports since 1996 when I graduated from school. Um, I've covered a number of world athletics championships, the African Games. This is my fourth African Games. Um, coincidentally, this time around, I'm not working as a journalist but I'm working as the media coordinator for the media team that are here. And so I have every time played a role in, I mean, in the media terrain so far as sports is concerned. Thank you very much, Mom. Thank you for having me.